padded by those 16 against Houston. And a block. It's Tark who leads the team in rejections, but it's Lee open for three. It's no good. And Tark, after a block a moment ago, is a Walsh. rebound. He steps back. Two pointer is going to rattle around and fall. And it's Riley Walsh, the first couple of points for NJIT this afternoon. That hit every part of the rim. <laughs> Who played into the game is Demir. Interesting guy. We'll talk about his story in a moment. And a putback no good. Eventually, Abdul Lewis, who leads the, sea, uh, the uh, Atlantic Sun in rebounding. He has another. Demir playing in his first game, eligible today after a transfer. And there's Tark through the middle. And that's another thing you and I were talking about pregame. Tark's been quiet in first half, so just about. And look wow. at that nifty move, but a block from behind. Return to center, DeAndre Wilson. Beautiful. 13 players in that game against Kane found the scoring column. Here's Wilson. Bullseye. He's been red hot from downtown. Yeah, shooting it at 54% from deep on the season. So good offensive rebound. Wilson goes up, puts it up, and one. DeAndre Wilson getting busy offensively early this afternoon. Well, good patience and ball movement. Actually, to Greer, nice look up top. Cooks, bullseye. What's cooking? A beautiful look by Greer. Yeah, Greer did a good job of getting himself in and then ben finding the to Bendari, but the pass a little bit off the mark. And look at Isabel just having fun out there like a game of horse in the backyard. Well, he gets wherever he wants on the floor, and so he's probing the defense all the time. And by doing Williams so, Williams back in. He's guarding Bendari. Nice spin move on the baseline for Mo, and he puts it in the Pharaoh. A beautiful move down low. Oh, good move, and then a good finish. by Williams out to Lee. Another crack. That one no good. And now it's Cooks off and running. Cooks three on two. Cooks will leave it, and Walsh will finish. Running the break like the old Showtime Lakers. Great job by Cooks in the open floor to not turn the basketball over. He had defensive pressure coming from Greer. To Tark, who launches. No good. And then Walsh just strips it away, and then he finishes over the shoulder. Rally Walsh. Cooks will take the jumper and knock it down. Zach Cooks. Well, there's where he utilizes his quickness. He's so quick coming off the screen, the defense Batted is great. around, Bendari using that frame, gets the rebound, and the Highlanders were off and running. What a save by Cooks, three on two. Here's Greer, goes up strong, and what a shot. Donovan Greer of finishing the Highlanders back in front. On the three-point line, including a couple of good open looks. That Gibbs. one was open, but that one went. Yeah, I was about to say, well, you know, when you need a shot, you go to Gibbs. This guy he gets it. Williams, one of the best shot blockers in the leg. But look at Bendari, who's the one that had a baby hook off that baseline. Well, he's giving them good, solid minutes here in the first half. On the Helping. floor, adds a whole different dimension to the offense. Walsh is open for three. Bullseye and a great start here to half number two. And that dimension to the offense is that Drexel's got to worry about him, so they send a double. Gives it up to Wilson. Not afraid to make a move and finish. Boy, Wilson can do it all. Oh, he finished through contact right there. Nice job getting it up on the glass. Park. And Riley Walsh, another uh, job keeping a possession alive. And Gibbs will finish. Walsh does that so well. Yeah, but that's the basket that the big guy, Abdul Lewis, has got to be able to Drexel. And it was only four. And a bullseye. Oh, and they run that little high post offense when they put the ball in Lewis's hands. Not only can he. Make the nothing <laughs> on the scoreboard that matters 42 40 Tark pokes it free two on one Wilson starts to fall and he's called for the travel as he couldn't catch his footing well sometimes you just get so excited the facets to his offensive game Lewis the trailer gets it and finishes it's Riley Walsh on the assist to the big man Lewis oh, good hands by Lewis running right there looked like he also it's finished back at dawn don't practice till late at night here's Wilson tough shot DeAndre Wilson hits from another uncompromising angle. Now he's been aggressive. Game Islanders, up. especially here in the second half. And Tark came back to get the block. Tark returns it to Sender, to Demir, all the way to Turkey. A lot of postage needed there, and he comes away with the basketball. How much is he Tark? It looks like he's been on him quite a bit. And there's Lewis, another fine feed from the big man Walsh in double figures as well. Lead has ballooned to a... He's guarding Lee. Sophomore just lost the handle, three on one. Ahead to Wilson, takes Mojica to the rack, gets fouled, doesn't finish, but Wilson's gonna get to the free throw line. Back nice cut. play. Tart to Walsh, another two points. A oh, great cut by Riley Walsh, but an even better feed right off Dragging the dribble. At the point of it. Tark in the corner, bullseye, and Anthony Tark is heated up here in the second half. 
a nice feed Another again. offensive rebound for Williams, who nearly threw it away and does. Gibbs ahead to Tark. Uh oh! And he misses the dunk, but gets the kiss. All right, the campus of Columbia is smiling to see Walsh playing so well. And look at Cook's a pickpocket. Came in tied for second in the A Sun and thefts, and he just grabs Started it away. To his own as a starter here. And Tark goes up, picks up the foul, and a chance at a three point play. But then he's teed up. Well, that's Anthony Tark's.